Hello, this is Tic Tac. Many of you have been asking me in the comments of my previous videos that you would like to toggle the mouse yoke for Microsoft Flight Simulator. So I found out a way how to do this and as you can see on the video up above I can toggle my uh, mouse yoke to move the camera around uh, without this affecting the control of my plane. This video is a continuation of my first video about how to create the mouse yoke, so if you haven't watched that, please watch it because you will have to do it before this. Let's get started with uh, creating the toggle for the mouse yoke. So first what we need to do is make sure the uh, virtual controller is not running. So we open up Task Manager and under Background Processes we may find virtual controller. You need to make sure that this isn't here, so to remove it, press end task. Because you need to make sure it's gone, because otherwise uh, it will get confused and won't work. Now we open up virtual controller, and we go to settings and controls. Uh, these four uh, binds are from uh, the first video, so if you've watched that, you should have this. And if you've watched uh, the second video about how to create a push to disable uh, control for the yoke, then you'll have two other ones. You can uh, keep the push to disable ones or you can delete them and now we will be adding the toggle to uh, disable mouse yoke. So if you want to have both options, you can have both. So what we need to do is press bind, create. And now we would do keyboard, button, and I'll put in comma because that's not used anywhere in the sim. So we find OEM comma here. And then press. And what we need to do is program. Uh, and then bind, bind zero, invert. OK. And then we copy this, paste it, bind one. OK. Copy, paste and then bind 2 and paste again and bind 3 and that uh, will be it now we close it and we run it and now we will get back to the sim to make sure everything works correctly this video is sponsored by Incredible Maths Incredible Maths is a great app in which you can learn and practice maths it has a wide range of content for different levels of abilities. You can download it on Google Play and get 30 days of Incredible Maths Premium free with the code. More details down in the description. Now let's get back to the video. Now after we've enabled the mouse yoke, uh, we can see here in the sim that uh, the lines move and when I press my comma key, uh, the lines stay in the same place and I can move the mouse and I'll be able to click buttons and move the camera in the cockpit without it interfering with the flight. And then when I press the comma again, I enable the yoke again from that same place I press the comma. So this doesn't reset the neutral position. So now we can start flying. So when we launch the sim and start playing, when I uh, press the comma key, I am able to move the camera around without it interfering with the controls of the plane. So thanks for watching this video and I hope it helped and you enjoyed it. If it did, please press the like button, subscribe for more videos and if you have any ideas for what videos I can make about Microsoft Flight Simulator, please put it down in the comments below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.